Hi campers, it's Miss Yaz and um, today's art lesson is brought to you by Picture Book Time and today I read a book called Boy. Um, so feel free to check that other video out. And it's about a dragon who is fighting uh, with people that live in a castle. And so I thought today, because it's got these cute illustrations at the front of the book, that I would teach you how to draw a dragon, and what else? A mushroom. What do you reckon if we learn how to draw a mushroom? And maybe a, a Viking hat. What do you reckon? Okay, let's start with a mushroom to warm us up. So with a mushroom, this is super easy. If you can do a semicircle, and you can do a line and some circles, you can make a mushroom. So, sorry the camera's not facing me today, but I didn't want to muck around with trying to get the camera angles right. So what I'll do, like that, is my mushroom, like this, and I might do something like this, do some bendy lines, might do another bendy line, and then I'm just gonna do some spots on my mushroom. Like this, and then inside I'll do lines because I don't know if you've seen under a mushroom. There's lots of lines under a mushroom and I'll do some zigzaggy lines for grass. So that's my mushroom. The next thing I'm gonna do is a Viking hat. So if you can do a rectangle like this, and a semicircle and some bendy lines, you could make a Viking hat or oh, and maybe a circle. So I'm gonna do a rectangle like that, long one. I'm gonna do like a semicircle on top. And I'm going to do some horns and some semicircles on the side and some circles in the middle. And there you've got a Viking hat and you could actually put a person under there like that. Like this. The next thing we're gonna do is a dragon, okay? So this has got a few more steps, but all to do with bendy lines. So if you can do bendy lines like this and semicircles like that, and little triangles up like this, we can do a dragon. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna first do a bendy line this way, like that. Then we're gonna do some semi circles like this on the either side. We're gonna do the nose. We're gonna do kind of these teardrops in his nostrils. You ready, keeping up? We're gonna do a smiley face over here. Then we're gonna do two bendy lines over here, like this. And we're gonna do another set of semicircles here. Can you see what's happening? We're gonna do some eyes, so we can color that in. Color this in. Give him some eyebrows. Oh, <laughs> he looks so big cross. <laughs> And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna do another bendy line under his chin, for his chin. Some puffy cheeks. And the top of his head. Then we're gonna do horns. And these straight lines here. And some lines. Then we're gonna do this weird looking shape that looks kind of like a hook, a backwards hook, like that. Then we're gonna do his legs, which are is just a bendy hook as well. And then his feet, which is some hooks. Look, and his heel. And then on his feet, we're gonna do some triangle for his claws, like that. And we'll do it over here as well, bendy line. And some more bendy lines for his feet. And some triangles for his claws. And then here we're going to do from his neck another bendy line. And I'm going to put a love heart in mine. Like that. 
do his arms like this. Another bendy line. Bendy line. Line. And three bumps. We'll do some triangles for his claws. Then we're going to do a line that's broken, but it's going to be his tail. Oh, and you can go as long as you want. Like that. And do triangles down his back. And then I'll do another bendy line here for his arm. There we go. There's my version of a, a dragon. So today we made a dragon, a Viking hat, and a mushroom. Okay, see you guys soon. Bye.